Wow. I like it a lot. You'll just have to hold a drink for all of a 90 second drive, yeah. but that's okay. That's okay. Yeah. Are you able to... <laughs> we are don't you, have what'd nails you get? on. What'd you get? I don't have nails on. Thank you. <laughs> ice white mocha with coconut milk. Light ice. Oh, Here, you too. Thank you so much. What's my drink? Why did I think I was going in reverse? Why am I having car nightmare meltdown emotions? The U-Haul was going in reverse. Wasn't drive. It was the opposite of drive. The worst part too is my mom's driving away because she's in front of me, right? You know, because she left me. And all I could think to do, frantic penguin. I'm just like. New adventures in crew neck. Miss Emily Jean is driving in front of me in the U-Haul. She is a saint. I already cried and we've already spent almost $100 in gas. Feeling all the emotions at once. I will tap in when I can. We just went past an entering Oregon sign all of 30 seconds ago. And then my car was immediately pelted with sand, bottles, garbage, and litter galore that is just absolutely caking the side of the freeway. Here's Emily. Hi. It's debris. <laughs> Hello. What'd you say? California girl! Welcome to my apartment. It is July 1st. It is my first full day here in LA. Actually not because I'm about to go work a wedding in San Diego. So I might not get to a lot of this today. So we'll see. Hopefully I can bring you along to the wedding. Tell me one fix. You know that's my sister. When she speak I listen. Okay, buddy. Okay? Okay. one that finishes it out that's in a different shape. Good morning guys. It is the first day waking up in my apartment and I am ready to get after it. This is what we're working with. It is the closet space. It is, I'm gonna put you down. It is kind of funky. Like a triangle and is this? Sturdy of a bar. Oh, it's a bar. Okay. I'm curious how stuff is gonna hang because since it's a triangle, I'm like, when stuff goes in on the side, is it gonna 
splay and fan out and are the clothes going to accordion a little bit because that could be kind of a nice look and make stuff easier to grab or just see what's actually in here it just in the end is going to make it to where really not as many things can be hung because they're all going to meet in a point back here this is the pile it's where i just punched a hole at the top and i had stuff just taken right off my hangers from the house um, immediately how they are. So everything should already be in order, rainbow order, all of that. I think I have six garbage bags that are covered and this is already two of them. So the way I organize stuff is really these skirts are random um they're new from aloe i'm super excited to wear them though i haven't i got them on um my last trip to la um but so the way i organize stuff is if it's a bodysuit uh like short sleeve top sleeveless top crop top anything small hot um and it goes rainbow to the best of my ability so i can tell that some of this is off just from the way i've pulled it out of the bags and then I immediately go into if it's a top top. So whether that's a blouse, a sweater, um, just a regular long sleeve top, anything of the sort. And then my other two sections would be jackets and dresses. And I already, I'm like, I think I'm going to have too much, too much hanger space. are two more packs of clothing and this is already what it's looking like over here so it's definitely fair to say that this closet can take up all of the clothing that i was even intending on putting on hangers which is awesome and then i think that back here is where i'm gonna try and put my laundry basket um because it's like out of sight anyways and what else am i gonna put back there shoe boxes um, they, would, they wouldn't even begin to fit back there, so no, we're not going to do that. Oh, no. I forgot about both of those, and they are filled with... Some gym stuff, sports bras, t-shirts, leggings, stuff like that. By the end of today, I will need to consume a meal. Maybe. I'm thinking, thinking that might happen. So I should probably set up the kitchen, but that'll be really fun because I do, I, I do have kitchen decor. Some of it is in the form of wine bottles. Not opened, okay? It's not a sorority. But, like, you know, like, waiting for all my guests, all my four guests that are going to come over and visit me. Well, I got wine, friends, so a little random sidebar. One of the other things about this unit that I do really like is since it is a corner unit, I have truly both sides of the living space covered in two big windows. So for one, I get all the natural light, don't need to turn anything on really during the day at all, um, electricity wise. But then two, because I have the windows, if all of them are open for a bit as things are cooling off, it, this is, space cools off a lot. Like there's, it just was almost freezing last night and I practically woke up because I was cold. So between that and the fact that even the kitchen also has a uh, window and the bathroom also has a window so I, I think the air circulation in here is high quality the exhibit kitchen exhibit bathroom oh nobody trip on your way back just you know wiggle past fall and winter um I'm apparently ready for winter because we just have on snowflake socks 
for the grippies. Oh, you need a sweep? That's okay. Wow, this is really that I started to forget about you and so I threw everything else in the box at the last second. It's not, it wasn't even close. Like it came here in the U-Haul like this. Wipes, sponges, Kleenex, shout out mom. I know she threw these in here. But also, yes, I'm so ready for Christmas. You guys, you guys, you guys. <laughs> Decor boxes? I don't really like to skirt automatically into fall. I like to savor it because it is truly one of my favorite seasons. I say that like there's 18 seasons. It is my favorite season of the four. And somewhere here, there is a box full of pumpkins. For being a freaking energy drink and chips technically, these are zero calorie energy drinks and these are the popcorners if you guys know, which is just, it's healthier because it doesn't have as much fat, but I had to take these out of what was supposed to go in my pantry box, but I have nothing to eat, so this is my snack break, thank you. And now that I just took this guy out of the fridge, there is now only one thing in the fridge and it is my last bang and it is. So I have one more bang in the fridge. It's because last night, while driving back from San Diego, I bought three for five. Um, I also found a gas station in Anaheim, a thrifty, that is under $6. I think it was $5.79, which is straight. I think that's actually a lot of the gas that I was paying up in um, Washington. Was that high right now? But the line, it was like, 8 p.m. at night and the entire parking lot was full because of course it's an extra 10 cents off if you could pay with cash and I was just like Wow and that green one please hold Yes but I know you see what just happened there. I'm so concerned about getting the metal hangers off because they don't match, but also just because on this type of rod, they're for sure gonna scratch and I just don't even wanna entertain that. And then my mom says, ah, now you know where I get it from. But like, it's good OCD. I was just thinking I need a trash can, trash bag, something or another, and I'm like, well, and all I have is all these empty plastic bags because I was just hanging out my closet and then I went, <laughs> I can tie the bottom and then now use the top, the hole where the hangers was, and now it's just a baby bag. Resourceful. Um, since I'm gonna start setting up the kitchen, outfit change, and also, it's summer, so. Thank you, I know my outfit's appropriate, thank you.